Good afternoon, everybody. I just wanted to hop on here real quick and give you a little heads up about the Animal Sense line of Young Living. Many of you may not even realize that there is a specific line of products produced and dedicated to animal use. One of my favorites is the Animal Sense Ointment. Unfortunately, Animal Sense Ointment right now is off stock because of the whole thing that's going on right now. And it's hard for them to get the ingredients that are needed. So it's a product supply issue that's preventing it from being um, available for us. But I wanted to share just a couple of testimonials about how they can be used and have been used successfully with different animals. And it's not just the animal ointment. They have animal sense shampoo. There's different oil blends. Um, Repel Aroma is one of them. I mean, there's a whole line of things. And I'll try to post a graphic of it for you. But I wanted to just share a couple of things here. One of them is... Um, it says, my grandmother's cat, Oscar, had mange and hair loss, was skinny, unhealthy, and just physically ill. Most of the family thought she was crazy to keep him around like he was. My grandmother asked if I knew of anything with Young Living that would help him. That's because none of the other vet creams had worked. She started using Animal Sense shampoo and Animal Sense ointment, and now Oscar is fluffy and healthy. Another one that I really liked was, let's see what happened to it. Oh, here it is. This is another one for a cat. I found a gaping wound on my cat, Tiger Lily's hind end. She was licking the wound profusely and was clearly in a lot of pain. It was bleeding and oozing pus. Using a plastic syringe from the drugstore, she first irrigated Tiger Lily's wound with salt water and a couple of drops of lavender oil. She said she then put Melrose and frankincense directly in the wound two to three times a day, followed by animal sense ointment. She also put Ningxia Red in her food two times a day and did two mineral soaks. It healed rapidly, and by day 12, all that was left was a small scab. Isn't that cool? There are so many testimonials in here. I mean, it could be any animal, including horses or cows or rabbits or guinea pigs. I mean, there's just all kinds of things that can be done um, using these products. It's always best to make sure you get a veterinarian's um, approval first. You know, have it make sure they're checked out. And other than that, though, it's, you know, proceed and use them. They're safe. Um, there was, oh, this one's a dog. And it says, my dog, Lila, was attacked by two other dogs and had numerous puncture wounds all over her body. One wound on her inner thigh turned necrotic, and she began chewing it. I tried to keep it wrapped, but it was in such a bad place that it was hard to keep a bandage on it, and it didn't help that she would inevitably chew. There, that's a little bit better. <laughs> she would inevitably chew it off anyway. The vet said it was okay for her to clean the wound of dead tissue, but I began to get concerned because she not only chewed the necrotic tissue off, but she then began to chew the healthy tissue. Soon, the ha soon she had a quarter-sized hole in her leg. The vet prescribed a wound gel, which did nothing. Finally, I decided to pack the hole with animal sense ointment, bandage it, and hope that it would stay on long enough to do some good. By the time I got home that night, sure enough, she had chewed the bandage off yet again, but the hole was already closing. The wound healed in what I thought was record time, and today she has no scar, only a place where the hair does not grow. <laughs> so again, friends, 
Animal Sense line. Um, this is the ointment, which I personally use for those rough and cracked heels that we can get. And it just is a really good thing for skin issues um, of all varieties. And if you haven't tried it, and you can mix other oils with it too, you know, like lavender or frankincense. So if you haven't tried it, it might be worth a try once it gets back into stock. Sorry, it's not in stock right now. But I will post a picture of what all the other Animal Scent line products are. Have a great day.